Well, hello and welcome to the Wellness Universe's Energy Forecast for the month of October in the year 2018. My name is Mitchell Osborne and I am a part of the Wellness Universe. The wellnessuniverse.com is a site and we have several social media places, um, our own social media group at wellnessuniverse.com where you can find peacekeepers, wellness healers, um, people of all different kinds of work coming to you to bring the energy and the work that they do to this world to make it a better and higher vibration place. So check it out. So here's your energy forecast for the month of October. Now, just a little side note. I remember reading this somewhere and I, I tried to research and find where I saw this, but I remember someone saying the month of October, it's a 10 month, is often like a snapshot of what the next year will bring. So if you look at October, at the end of October, look back and say, okay, this is what my 20... 19 years going to kind of look like in a nutshell. Um, so, so keep an eye out for that as you move through October. But here's what I have to bring for you for the energy forecast. So what can you expect? I feel like we're going to have some more of that slow moving, very earthy, grounded spiritual work that we've got going on. But I believe it's finally going to come to an end. I think many of us through October, and I'm feeling like 15th, 18th, we're going to all go, ah, wow, this has been a challenging couple of months or maybe even a year for a lot of people. And it's like, we can breathe again. It's like we're finally able to exhale. And then how can we best navigate this energy? I really feel like we're going to be able to look back and see how we can move quicker through that type of energy um, from the learning, from the strengthening that we've been through. It's like, We've practiced the marathon, now it's time to run it, and we feel so much better because we worked up to it, and it feels easy now. And here's the biggest thing I think you can navigate the month of October. Allow the endings to happen. Stop holding on to things that you're kind of like, gosh, I don't like this anymore. And then all of a sudden it ends and you're like, well, wait a minute, I want it back. Relationship, job, whatever it may be, allow the endings to happen naturally. And then the, how are you going to grow? What are you going to learn from it all? I really feel like you're going to learn how to bring things back into balance. I feel like you're going to be able to assimilate knowledge and understanding as well as pass it on to others that you, what you've learned to be able to pass it on. But I really feel like you're going to just come out of it shining bright, this beautiful, like, just powerful, illuminating energy. So um, last month, I remember thinking, oh, man, I was hoping I was going to give like this great message, but it's like we still had some more work to do collectively. So this is the month where I feel like, again, 15th, 18th, I feel like things are really going to shift. <sighs> we're going to be able to exhale and move forward, balance, feeling good, but also learning and knowing how to assimilate and work through the energies that we've already been through for the last two, three, six months to 12 months, maybe even as long as 18 months, depending on who you are, where you are, and what's going on in your life. So there you go. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Please feel free to share this and um, check out uh, thewellnessuniverse.com. I'm there, Mitchell Osborne, and I will talk to you soon. Have a good one. Bye-bye. <music>